popular trending news article on Connect Chibos titled Update Police Charge Suspect in Fatal Shooting of Chicago's Rapper King Von Wright. A man has been charged with murder in the fatal shooting of Chicago rapper King Von. The suspect, Timothy Leak, 22, was charged with felony murder after the Atlanta Police Department secured warrants on Saturday, November 7th. According to the Atlanta Journal Constitution, King Von, 26, whose real name are Davon Bennett, was shot around 3.20 a.m. Friday, during an argument between two groups of men that escalated to gunfire. According to a statement provided by Officer Steve Avery with the Atlanta Police Department, Bennett was taken to an area hospital where he died. The incident took place outside Monaco Hoka Lounge, where two of duty officers who were in uniform and working an extra job at the lounge. Along with an on-duty officer who was patrolling nearby, confronted the arguing groups. Shots were fired, police said. Read more details on these Unconnect You Boss. Next popular news story on Connect You Boss, titled Babatunde Fowler returns to EFCC over 9.2 billion allegedly linked to his account, Right. Baba Tunde Fowler, former chairman of the Federal International Revenue Service, fees on Monday returned to the Economic and Financial Crimes Commission, EFCC. For further questioning, Fowler was said to have reported at the Lagos State Office of the EFCC over five's involvement in alleged financial misappropriation during his tenure. Read more details on these unconnectables. Ten popular news stories unconnectables titled Man Stabbed to Death Over Girlfriend in Bauchi Rights. An 18 year old man identified as Kabiru Ahmed has been arrested by men of the Bauchi State Police Command for allegedly stabbing another man to death over a girlfriend. The spokesperson of the State Police Command, BSP Ahmed Wakil, said in a statement released that a resident of the state reported the matter to the police. On November 11, 2020, about 9.45 p.m., a distress call was received from a good Samaritan that one Hamza Usman, 23 of age, of Aguwa Mahukata, Bahuchi went to the house of his girlfriend by the name Ramla Sheshu, 15, of the same address. He was attacked and stabbed in his church by one Gabiru Ahmad, 18, of Karofi. Read full articles on these unconnectables. For top popular news stories, unconnectables titled, We are not in a military regime. Buba Galadima asks FFG to unfreeze bank accounts of NSAS promoters' right. Member of the Board of Trustees of the All Progressives Congress and a strong ally of President Buhari, Buba Galadima, has condemned the recent action of the Central Bank of Nigeria freezing the bank accounts of NSAS promoters. Speaking on Arise TV this morning, Galadima said the action is unconstitutional as Nigeria is not in a military regime. What the government has done is not right. It has no such rights or powers to block bona fide Nigerians from traveling out of the country or from accessing their bank accounts. Blocked for what? What have they done? These young men were peacefully protesting the actions, omissions, or commissions of government. Get more knowledge of these unconnectables. Last trending news article on connectables titled Young the Six Begs Davido and Bonaboy to Quash Their Differences Over Fear It May Escalate. Right. Rapper Young Six has called on Davido and Bonaboy to quash their reported beef over fear it could escalate. 
The singers are said to have been at Lockheed for some time and it remains unclear what led to their beef. Reacting on Twitter, Young Six urged them to end their beef over fear the people around them could take the class to the next level. According to the rapper, nobody wins when the family is in disagreement. Read more details on these unconnectables. This brings us to the end of the 630 News on CMTV. It was compiled and edited by Nabilia Christia under the supervision of Quine Chamber and presented by Bongni Marie Claire. Stay tuned for more upcoming amazing programs on CMTV and I wish you a great week.